what's up everyone and welcome back to my channel it's your girl can me here with another video and today y'all i'm going to be reviewing a new perfume to me okay it's not a new perfume it came out i believe in 2018 and as you can already tell from the thumbnail what i'm going to be talking about it is the coach dreams sunset perfume and if you already watched my previous video on the whole perfume exchange my husband and i surprised each other with a new cologne and perfume but he didn't know that he picked up a cologne because i guess the girl thought the doja and gabbana light blue was for him anyways needless to say i opened up a bottle of cologne so i went back the next day with the intention of picking up the perfume but i went to another ulta beauty and i saw that they had the coach dream sunset and i had smelt this recently but they didn't have the bottle and so when i saw this i was like let me just go ahead and exchange it for this because i can get the dolce and gabbana light blue anytime you know what i'm saying so your girl opted for this and this is a 2.0 fluid ounce retails for about 82 dollars and yeah, y'all, I got this and I'm so excited. The bottle is adorable. It has a little sunset vibe going on, you know, the little ombre look and, you know, the logo, the coach logo, the horse and carriage. And then the top here is the little flower. Now we'll say the itemizer is, ooh, it's it's okay, but sometimes when I'm like spraying it all over, it, it can get kind of difficult. And you know, I don't like difficult stuff, so yeah i'm gonna just say that but other than that i love this perfume the smell is just amazing oh my goodness so i was spraying this when i got it in my car and i was thinking this smells like something that i already have and i couldn't pick, put i couldn't put my finger on it so when i got home i went home and i sprayed this right here this dahlia and y'all this smells just like it this dahlia smells just like Mm. oh the coach dreams and i was like yes i have a layering combo yes ma'am now i will say that i've already used the lotion up and i purchased this like in the winter time like i think january and the thing about body sprays and lotions when you purchase them at bath and body works is that you tend to use a lotion quicker than the body spray so you end up with just body spray you know what i'm saying and anyways I would say like maybe make the body sprays a little shorter but then some people some people gonna start complaining and saying oh I'm bath and body works trying to jet bus blah 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 but anyways y'all um yes this dahlia smells just like the coach stream sunset and i've been layering them together so the fragrance notes in this dahlia is velvet dahlia petals crisp pear praline musk whipped tonka bean so yep it has the exact same notes as the coach dream sunset which i'm going to go over so the top notes is pear which oh which the dahlia has and then the middle note is jasmine which i love i love anything that smells like jasmine when i tell you the gucci bloom is my number one perfume right now i kind of toss to the side the miss dior absolutely blooming and the Gucci Bloom has been my scent of the day lately. And it, 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 it's probably going to be my signature scent. Let's just, let's, let's make that clear. Probably, probably going to be my signature scent. But anyways, um, yeah, so the middle note on the Coach Dream Sunset is Jasmine. And the bottom note is Tonka Bean. So these have the exact same notes minus the Jasmine. And yeah, these pair perfectly together. So if you pick this perfume up, this right here could be a signature scent, y'all. This could be a signature scent, and I feel like any perfume can be worn all year round. It's just how you spray it. Like, for instance, I, I would spray this kind of heavy in the winter months because, I don't know, like crisp air. Sometimes you just need a heavier spray as opposed to the summer months. I would probably spray this like one or two times and be good because the heat is just going to mix with it and it's just going to be so overwhelming so it's just all about how you spray perfume to me you know we all think differently but that's just my thoughts um anyways um people have also said that this could be a carolina herrera dupe the original good girl 
so if you've smelt that or if you have that perfume then i wouldn't suggest picking this up because why would you get a perfume that smells just like something else i mean unless you're trying to grow your collection like your girl is because <laughs> that's probably something i would do now i will say that the carolina herrera that i like is the Laguerre, and that probably will be my next purchase but i feel like the Laguerre almost smells like um fabric softener i don't know i get that vibe but it smells good it does have jasmine in it and that's what really gets me you know what i'm saying but anyways um the longevity on this is about four to five hours on your skin when people say like six to seven hours i'm like what what perfume are you wearing because the only perfumes i feel last for about at least six to seven hours i would say is my ysl that's like my number one powerhouse that i know for a fact is going to last on my skin for six to seven hours now on your clothes if you're a heavy sprayer then yeah it'll probably last about six to seven hours okay but if you're spraying perfume on your skin especially right here on your wrist your pulse points right here and you wash your hands a lot or you put lotion on or hand sanitizer eventually it's going to start like rubbing away even on your neck or whatever perfume doesn't last that long on your skin to me it doesn't i'm just being honest um now if you spray it on your clothes then of course it's going to last longer but um the performance on this i would say is an eight out of ten maybe a nine out of ten i wore this to rehearsal one day and this girl was walking behind me and she was like what are you wearing you smell so yummy i was like girl that's that cold stream sunset girl let me put you on right quick i love when people compliment me i love when i smell other women who just smell delicious and delightful and i be asking them girl what are you wearing so i can know so i can smell good you know even though i don't want to smell like you okay but i want to know what you're wearing anyways so i see a lot of people talk about layering different perfumes mixing them together i don't know i'm just not that type of person like i'm not that bold enough to mix two different perfumes unless they have like identical notes like identical like they have to be in the same family and i'm sure that's what people are talking about when they say they layer it um anyways y'all said all that to say that this right here is a great purchase i definitely suggest picking this up if you want to try something different or new or i don't know if you want to know about this perfume and what i think i think it's an awesome buy and yeah that's my thoughts on it guys and um right now today is april 2nd 2022 right now um macy's has a sale on their perfumes which is so 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 rare it's 15 percent off and you guys saw i picked up a gucci bloom 1.0 fluid ounce your girl went on the macy's website and she ordered a full 3.5 i believe fluid ounce of the gucci bloom so i have a full bottle and i'm pretty satisfied because i saved 15 percent. so go to macy's girl and get you some perfume right now because it's on sale and you don't want to miss it because i sure didn't anyways y'all um i will also say that victoria's secret has a sale going on also again today's april 2nd y'all and i'm telling you guys this if you're watching it 5.99 for their lotions and body sprays and if you get their email updates you probably already know so but it's it's still okay for me to tell you right right anyways y'all thank you guys so much for watching this video if you if you like to give it a thumbs up if you guys have any questions leave them down in the comment sections below and as always y'all have a very very blessed week